IoT stands for Internet of Things, smart devices, smart phones, smart watches, and we think about it in a commercial context as wearables on workers monitoring their location, their ergonomics, water pressure sensors on buildings checking for leaks. The industry is still trying to figure out how to effectively take advantage of all of this new data in a way that makes sense and is valuable. What we're finding is there is significant value across the value chain that the data can have, not only here at the Hartford, but across the industry as well. We have two main strategic objectives. The first is to use IoT devices to predict, prevent, detect, and mitigate insurance losses. The second is to use data from connected devices to develop unique value propositions for our customers. At the most basic level, if customers are utilizing IoT technology to be safer, drives down risk from an insurance standpoint, they deserve to pay less in insurance premiums. We're experimenting with water damage prevention across properties, whether it be construction sites or buildings. The presence of water throughout the building, so it may be around sinks or plumbing fixtures, HVAC, places where we've seen those types of water damage claims, so that when water hits the device, it will send an alert to the customer to check on the site, make sure everything's okay, and even turn the water off. The insurance industry will move from more of a reactive model to a service model that involves risk prevention. And with real-time IoT data and big data, we should be able to prevent a lot more claims from even happening in the first place, which is, I think, a fantastic service that we can offer to customers in the future. When you can find something that makes the industry better, you glom onto it, and then you try to incentivize policyholders to use it. And it's a very easy sell for us. At the Hartford, we truly are putting our money where our mouth is when it comes to human achievement. So when we come into a situation or we encounter a situation where we can, can use IoT to prevent accidents, mitigate the damages, or prevent losses, there's full buy-in. When you look at water sensors at a larger scale, yes, they'll prevent water, but might they also have an opportunity to give you insight into water management or energy conservation. Um, so there's a lot of value beyond just the typical loss prevention that I think will start to become more prevalent as we scale. There's a lot of companies I think that are talking about uh, doing innovation, but the Hartford is actually doing and has committed resources to actually uh, executing uh, innovation for their customers.